Here we go, boys. Here we go. Have fun tonight, eh? Here we go, boys. Here we go. Let's go strong here. Here we go. Good. How are you? Good. Good. Another night. Here we go. Hey, back up there. Want your sticks on? Let them set up. Put your stick on the white. On the white. It's hard to believe. Like I was trying to think of actually my first game, regular season game in the OHL, and I can't even remember what uh, what game it was. But a thousand games uh, at any level. Um, it's it's an accomplishment that I'm, I'm proud of myself for uh, getting to and doing and uh, obviously staying healthy to be able to do it. Um, you know, me, to me, it's a, it's accomplishment that uh, you know, I put up there with some of the other things I've done in my career, for sure. Coming up, man. Coming up, coming up. We're good. I'm a forester for the city of Kitchener. I've been there coming up 21 years. And uh, yeah, we're, uh, you know, uh, finish work at three o'clock, uh, shower work, jump in the car, get home at one, two, maybe two, three, some mornings, back up at 5.30, do it all over again. Get that line, get that line, get that line, good. There's so many memories and, and that, but I, I still always go back to the camaraderie and and the dealings with groups and, and the guys and having fun. like. The, the, the nights, the hours spent in cars and some good laughs, some good nights. And, um, it, you know, it it's flown by, I'll tell you that. 22 years and a thousand regular season games, it's, it's flown by. It's been quick, that's for sure. There's some good nights, there's some bad nights. But I think what you take away from it is that you're skating with the best junior hockey players in the best junior league in the world. And... In my 22 years of on the ice, the guys I've seen come through the Ontario Hockey League, I, I turn my TV on every night and there's a superstar in every team that was a part of the Ontario Hockey League in my career as an official. And to see the growth of them and their development, it's pretty awesome to see them start as a 16 or a 17, or in some cases like John Tavares and some of the other guys as a 15 year old. And to see what they do nowadays, yeah, it's pretty gratifying to see that. I enjoy that. There's consistency, and then there's Kevin Hastings, who continuously in the OHL is constantly regarded as one of the top linesmen. A lot of players like it when they see number 61 on the ice wearing the stripes. Yeah, if you can have a, a, fit, a linesman that's been in the league for a long time, you know that he's obviously earned all that keep to be there, and everyone knows that you, you respect his calls when he makes them. I really enjoy still being on the ice and go back to the point of being with the up and coming superstars and seeing those guys. And I really tried to help with more of a mentorship role with the Ontario Hockey League and working with the young guys and seeing them uh, move up to the next level. Uh, that's what keeps me going right now. I really enjoy, you know, what I learned years ago when I got into this, I, I wouldn't be here without guys like mentorships from Ken Cox, Bill Prisniak, Brad Beer, Jim Carmen. Uh, these guys, they were hard on me, but uh, I, I look back at it, I needed it, and I took their words and I just went hard every night, that's it.